it's Thursday the 11th of April. It's time for the Bath College's Easter Dawn. Welcome, Welcome to, to Yorkshire. Yorkshire. It might be a bit windy. <laughs> Have we forgotten something? something. Would do at that precise moment. Camera. That's very good. Oh, there's a very good talk. Excuse me. Oh, we can make some fabulous home movies. Oh. <laughs> what? Yeah. Um. 
that's it for day one in the Yorkshire Dales. Uh, I've had some very good towers, especially Skipton. Really enjoyed ringing those. Um, just got one more thing to do now, which is to go and ring a quarter peel at Otley. And hopefully find some warm bedding for this evening. So it's not central, is it? It's not central at all. No, it's not not this, one does, this one does the same. The right. Mind. So, this evening's dessert is a chocolate and ginger tort. So, this recipe calls for some cream, uh, such as this. I don't think that's enough. <coughs> uh, perhaps a bit more cream, I think. a little more uh, uh, cream. Ah, that's looking good. Uh, perhaps just a li little more cream. Yeah, this is a little more. Uh, next we need to add a little cast of sugar to sweeten, uh, such as that. That should be enough. Uh, and we now need uh, 225 grams of butter. 250. That'll do. Now we need a second pan to prepare the chocolate and put in also the butter, which I put in there by mistake and I should now put in here. Uh, because I'm going to boil that, uh, but not this. Um, so butter is now in here, slightly covered in cream, uh, but uh, we now need to add the chocolate. So for this we require uh, Waitrose Finest, of course. Other brands of chocolate are available. Uh, we have five bars, I think, will be sufficient for this. Uh, so I just now need to break all this up into little pieces and put it in here. Um, that seems somewhat like effort, so uh, we'll do it the easy way, like this. And there we go. Uh, so I'm now heating up the cream and waiting for it to boil. Still waiting for it to boil. Still not boiling. Bored now. <sighs> and finally the cream. And finally the cream has boiled. Uh, so we can now pour it on the chocolate and then I think we're more or less done. From, apart from stirring this for about half an hour whilst the, uh, the chocolate melts. But, but we're nearly there. Okay, Lizzie, and what are you going to do? I'm going to just take these ginger nuts.
Good morning. Uh, you joined us at a slightly noisy Kirby Mouse here this morning. Uh, we're off to uh, Ripon next after this, and then a few other towers, including Middlesmore this afternoon, which should be good. Had a slightly warmer night in the hall. Um, but I think most people went for that, let's drink as much as we can, and then we won't notice how cold it is. Um, so much so that I believe Richard took all his clothes off, but most disappointingly, there is no film evidence of this whatsoever. <laughs> oh well. Uh, we got dessert done last night, so we just got to do the other three courses when we get back. So, see you later. Smell beer.
good smell beer. So here we are at the end of day two, fantastic location of Middlesmoor, some stunning scenery on the way over here and more to look forward to as we go back down to Pateley Bridge. A quick shot of that here. Rose, Lizzie and I will be heading straight off from there to cook our four course dinner. Uh, so I'll leave you with this fantastic scenery. Thank you for watching. Okay, Lizzie, and what are you going to do? I'm going to take these ginger nuts.